Well, good morning, everybody, and thanks for joining me again. Uh, this is going to be an update, probably in several parts of the Ski Nautique project. And I now have a stock room full of parts, hose clamps, water pumps, raw water filter, bilge pump, uh, electrical parts, uh, oil parts, fiberglass, carbon fiber, and most significantly, hoses. We have hoses, three inch hoses, intake water hose at one inch, regular hose, lots of hoses. Now, The problem I have is I need to do fiberglass work before I can stick in the exhaust hose. And as you can see, it's 50 degrees out. Not good. Okay, so here's what the back of the boat looks like. And basically I'm working on the transom area. I've pulled, as you know, the three inch exhaust pipes out of it and have cleaned it up a little bit uh, from all the muck that was down there and then down in here the side of the this uh, stringer back here um, has a problem so what happened was, apparently this all got wet and the piece of fiberglass that went from the bottom up to the top to cover us and keep it dry um, cracked and separated. I don't know whether that was from heat or vibration or motor stuff the gasoline dripping in there but I guess not because the other side has the exact same problem if we look over here so it had something to do with the exhaust itself um, so yesterday I cut that piece of fiberglass that was hanging there cut it out and then today I've got to uh, sand down the surrounding areas, prep it for new fiberglass, and then when it gets warm enough, 50 degrees out today, um, I'll put new roving mat in there and seal it back up. But I can't put the pipes back in, or the, the new pipes back in, um, until that's done as they go, you know, right through this channel. And uh, so that's all on hold until um, this fiberglass work gets done. So what I might do is I might start around the engine and start with the intake hoses and uh, replace them, install the raw, raw water intake filter um, that uh, the boat did not have before and work in that area until this fiberglass work is done and I can proceed back here. So that's the update and uh, thanks for joining me. Yeah, I'll give you another update when uh, either I have the engine hoses in progress or the fiberglass done before I put the the big uh, three inch pipes back. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. See ya.